Hey guys, in this video we have some work from home jobs you can get worldwide without having to be on the phone and one of them is at Trafalia.com. This is a e-commerce group that builds and expands transformative brands online. They usually have a lot of marketing jobs and things like that and they also hire worldwide. They have something called an SEO manager available right now which is a remote job at a global company as they say right here and they don't put any restrictions here for location on this job that I've seen on here and so you should be able to apply from anywhere in the world so they have over 300 employees working around the world as well so they're used to having people work in all sorts of different places and they're looking for a result oriented and problem solver SEO manager to plan manage and execute search engine optimization and organic search strategies across all their domains driving channel growth. So you're going to help them get more traffic and basically do that through content marketing through SEO, which is basically going to focus a lot on Google. Usually you will take your content for the website that you're working with in in this case Trafalia's brand and you will help optimize it so that it pops up when people search for related topics to what Trafalia offers in Google and other search engines. So you're going to be doing a lot of research, a lot of optimization, a lot of stuff with websites, things like that. You'll design, implement, and manage these strategies with a quarterly roadmap. Ensure compliance for SEO best practices execution. Make sure SEO is considered in all decisions and marketing campaigns. So it's a big, big part of their marketing efforts. Uh, work with the SEO specialist to specify, schedule, and deploy SEO improvements and best practices. You'll develop and manage SEO projects in partnership with cross-functional teams to ensure execution as planned. Build strategic planning with the content team for new content on the site. You'll also optimize existing content, so which could be blog posts and things like that that are on the website. So you'll have you'll help them plan new ones and help optimize old ones and update them. You'll own SEO KPI monitoring results and share insightful opportunities with stakeholders. Monitor the overall technical health of the sites by implementing improvements and providing recommendations to the development team when necessary and develop, manage, and constantly improve SEO dashboards with the key mon metrics to monitor, which will probably be things like click-through rate, you know, overall traffic, views, things like that. Requirements, strong communication skills, Great skills for data analysis and capability to apply it effectively. Problem solving skills, ability to understand the big picture, ability to understand current knowledge of digital project management systems and tools. So this could be Asana, G Suite, Slack. Pro proven ability to effectively lead and manage multiple projects. Strong structured thinking skills. Proven ability to prioritize meet deadlines and make use of limited resources and fluency in English. So. With this, mostly, if you are going to be talking to people, now when I say a non-phone job, you're pretty much always going to have to talk to people in any job that you do. It's just whether or not you're having to talk to customers or not. So like with sales and customer support, usually you have to talk to customers directly all the time. A lot of people don't want to do that. And so with this one, the only people you're probably going to be talking to most of the time are people that you work with. So you're, you can avoid dealing with the public directly. What they have to offer is proximity, doesn't include pro influence productivity. They're globally distributed. You can live and work wherever you want. A rich experience including the opportunity to collaborate with world-class talents. I mean, they give you a few things here. Those aren't really what I would call traditional benefits. But if you want to see more of their traditional benefits, you can go to their careers page. They have a training budget for courses, conferences, events, and things like that. They have paid vacation. And then you get performance bonuses, access to co-working spaces. You have a health insurance subsidy, technology stipend for your home office. You also get paid to exercise and meditate. And then you have family leave as well. So you have obviously the ability to work from home worldwide on top of that. As far as what it's like to work here, salary wise, they didn't have anything specifically for this job on here for Trafalia's, but an average one pays around 83500 a year in total pay, but the base pay is about 76000 a year. I think it would be closer to that because I don't, you, you'll get some benefits and things like that, but you probably won't have a lot of 
performance-based incentives for these types of jobs usually, although, like I said, they do have a benefit for that on here if you look at performance bonuses. So you might actually be higher end on the higher end of this average here, which is actually a full range of 66 to 107,000. But you may be closer to 83,000 a year because they do actually offer performance-based incentives. But if you were to look at the reviews for Trafalia as a company, their employees give them a 3.8 out of 5 rating. 77% recommend working here to a friend. Benefit-wise, you have a 4 out of 5 star rating, but only one rating so far, so it's hard to draw a lot of conclusions from that. 3.2 out of 5 difficulty rating for interviewing here out of 50 people. And um, at least most of them, the majority had a, a positive experience interviewing here. Another company to check out right now is called Product Hunt. ProductHunt.com is the website. They are a company where they basically have people upvote the newest technology products and services that are coming out right now. And then you get to see live rankings all the time of what people are upvoting for the newest and best technology ideas. So it's kind of a way to find new tech. And then they have an advertising operations specialist, which is remote worldwide, as you can see. It is full time. And they are seeking an ambitious ad operations specialist to join the revenue team to help manage the ads campaign. The ideal candidate has two plus years of experience in ad operations, strong understanding of the digital advertising landscape. So you're familiar with things like CPC, CTR, CPM, things like that. Excellent data analysis and problem solving skills. You might be working with tools like Excel and Periscope, for instance, and strong communication interpersonal skills. And then the type of person that fits their culture is curious, authentic, bold, empathetic, and kittenish. And then some of the benefits you get here are competitive salary, wellness stipend, full health insurance coverage. If you live in the U.S. and a generous stipend for outside the U.S. Company paid laptop, work from home setup, and monthly internet stipend. A fluid work schedule. You can work when you're most productive. Generous vacation time. Hard work deserves time off. Wellness Mondays. First Monday of the month is your time. Professional development stipend. And then live wherever. You can work from anywhere pretty much you want. As far as salaries, they don't have this specific job on here either. They, don't, they really just don't have a lot of feedback on salaries yet or in general for their Glassdoor page, but um, the typical advertising operations specialist makes around $52,000 a year. So it might be in that ballpark because they do say they offer competitive salaries. Five reviews so far, and you have a 3.5 out of five star ratings. 48% recommend working here to a friend. Benefit wise, they have a four out of five star rating, although just one rating and then interview wise, so far, they have a 2.5 out of 5 difficulty rating, but they just don't really have a lot of information yet on their Glassdoor page to really draw a good conclusion yet. Usually, you want to have a few dozen people give feedback first. Um, so the sample size is just kind of small right now. So I would take that with a grain of salt. Next, you have a company called AwesomeMotive.com. They are helping small businesses grow and compete with big guys through traffic, email subscribers, revenue, and things like that. So they have a WordPress technical support job. So if you want probably the easiest job on this list, it would probably be this one. It's a customer support or technical support. It does say Palm Beach Gardens, Florida, United States. That's just their home base. That's their headquarters. You don't actually have to work there. They're a worldwide company and you can work from pretty much anywhere at home. And You'll be responsible for guiding people to the fullest use of the products and build relationships with customers to help them. But they do seem to say that you are going to be doing this through inbox, support tickets, things like that, that are not phone based. So what they're looking for in a person is passionate about solving problems and helping people incredibly positive and enjoy making another person's day. Excellent communicator, self starter, curious, desire to learn, grow your skills, and take pride, quality, and craftsmanship. Now, your common responsibilities will be some of the following. Working the support inbox, making sure customers receive timely responses. So that tells me chat and email support. Fielding and re recording feature requests, providing support to users on forums for plugins. So another 
form of text-based support, testing bug reports locally, and then passing them to the development team, pre-release quality assurance testing, updating and creating tutorials and documentation, writing code snippets, and communicating with the team and supporting your peers using chat, audio, and video. So pretty much all of these, except maybe uh, communicating with the team is going to be all text-based or coding or something. Not really coding, but like, you know, testing bug reports and quality assurance, email, chat support, nothing really phone related on here. The only people you would actually talk to might be like a, a Zoom call with your coworkers every once in a while. Requirements, excellent English writing communication skills, patience, grace, and sense of humor, exceptional troubleshooting abilities, at least two years of experience with WordPress, strong comprehension of HTML and CSS, strong leadership. You can take technical lingo, make it understandable, ability to prioritize workloads in order to balance um, multitasking, personal computer with internet access, and availability to participate in meetings between 9 a.m. and 5 p.m. Eastern time. Bonus points if you also have proficiency in writing documentation, prove a track record providing support for WordPress plugins, experience working with email marketing service providers, experience with WordPress development and working knowledge of PHP. And then they mentioned your benefits at the bottom here. You have competitive salary. You have lots of insurance benefits if you're full-time in the US, health insurance benefits for all employees in India, Pakistan, Brazil, and Ukraine. Work from home, they're spread all over the world. Benefits may vary by the country, though. Unlimited paid time off after 90 days. Paid maternity and maternity leave. Happily provide or reimburse software you'll need as well as books or courses that promote continued learning. Give you the opportunity to solve challenging and meaningful problems that make a difference. Custom branded laptop after five years. Cover all costs of company travel. Ability to work with some of the best people in the business. And no BS politics or jerks. So they were basically saying they have a good culture. And as far as what's like to work here, technical support at Awesome Motive typically pays a total of 64, 65,000 a year. Or so with a 52 to $53,000 base pay. So pretty good paying job, especially for customer or technical support. 4.6 out of five stars, 89% recommend working here to a friend. So very highly rated with a good sample size of reviews. Seven ratings, 4.2 out of five for benefits. Pretty good there, although still not a ton of ratings. Out of 15 ratings for interviews, 2.7 out of five difficulty. 73% had a positive experience, so that's a good sign as well. So hopefully this was helpful. Don't forget to subscribe and click the notification bell if you want more daily work from home opportunities like these. And don't forget to leave a comment with more work from home ideas that you would like me to cover in the future, and I'll see you in the next video.